Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've got a little bagging to do today. And this one has come to me from the good people at fgnormal.com. So yay! Uh, I've had quite a few packages from them in the past and they asked if I would like some more products to show you. Yes, of course, because they've got a lot of new products on the site at the moment. And there is a special on at the moment uh, for seven days only. There is 25% off on the website. So yay, go and check that out. Uh, if you spend over £40, it's free shipping. And if you add five to your basket, you'll only pay for four. So loads of special offers up. So yeah, oh, great. Right, what did we get this time? Oh, we have a diamond painting. And oh, we have a little special project. Okay. So let's have a look at the project first. Now, I hope you like these as much as I uh, did when I spotted them on the website. Because they're very, very cute. Right, where do we get into them? Come on, where's the opening? There it is. Okay, da 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 da. Pen boat and wax. <laughs> All special drills. Oh, and some specials as well. Look, crystals and specials. And they are the little corner bookmarks, but they're gonks, look. And they're in pink. So we have a little girl with a bow in her hair and a hat. We have another little girl. This one's got a grey cover with the pink underneath. They're all pink underneath, that's why I got them. And she's got a couple of balloons there. Aren't these great? I just, oh, I love these bookmark things. But when I saw these, I thought I've just got to get these. And then we've got the little gonk there. That's a little boy one, I think. Uh, yeah, because he's not got pigtails. <laughs> I think that's his moustache with daisies. But they're all dressed up as ladybirds. So two of my favourite things at the moment. Ladybirds and gonks. So then we've got the lemony one. And he's got a ladybird actually on his hat. Look. <laughs> And then we've got that one who's actually got like a ladybird outfit on. Look, he's got like the wings at the back there. <laughs> and then another little girl. Oh, so we've got three chaps and three ladies. There you are. So, yeah, look at those. Oh, we've got two pink ones. Oh, they're different pinks though. One's a slightly darker pink than the other. But aren't they fab? Oh, I just thought, got to have those. Must have, absolutely. And um, for the set of six, it was $12.55, which I didn't think was bad because you can either use them as six presents or you can use them for yourself. I mean, what I've decided I'm going to do, I know it's putting these upside down, but I'm going to put them on the wall as little pockets. So I'm going to put a command strip or something on the back and have it on the wall. And actually, you could have it sideways as well. So if you wanted to, say, have a pair of scissors on the wall, it will fix you all with a command strip and you can just pop something in there so yeah actually they will go that way uh, some of the patterned ones will go up that way so you can put things in that way around but actually these with them being the little gonks uh yeah I, thought, oh, I can put them that way i mean i could put them that way but uh, yeah everything would drop out but that was just an extra idea i had for them and i just thought oh yeah i've got to get those and, and to be honest, they would just make quite nice little dinky doodars on the wall as well, wouldn't they? <laughs> okay, so they're like a, a felt backing. It reminds me of, uh, you know, you used to get table savers, um, like a big tablecloth, but have like a felt backing so that you didn't, if somebody put a hot cup or a hot pan or something on the table, it sort of absorbed the heat. It reminds me of that kind of material. And then you've got like the faux leather, the EVA plasticky type leather on the front there. And then, uh, yeah, just the little gonks. Ooh, these are sewn in. I'm not quite so keen on that. But with this being sort of a harder plastic rather than a canvas, I think these will come out a lot easier. Yeah, they will. Um, yeah, it's one of my pets. You know, like when you get um, cushions and things like that they've got the cover sheet sewn in it can be quite difficult to get out but these look with them being a bit smaller as well these do look as though they're going to come out a little bit easier yeah they are it's just as supposed to keep the cover sheet on uh I prefer they didn't do it but it's not uh, any great shakes on these 
but yeah oh these are super so yeah ladybird themed gonks and i do like the little color palette as well yay oh i don't know which is my favorite let me see i mean i like him because he's got the ladybird there look on his hat i think i'm quite drawn to this one with the big daisy on the top of her hat there yeah yeah she's just stood there she's got her antennae look actually have they all got antennae no the the girl ones have they've all got the like ladybird little antennae mm. do ladybirds have antennae i don't think they do do they butterflies do but ladybirds don't he hasn't he's just oh he's got two ladybirds so he's got two ladybirds on his hat and his ladybird wings <laughs> oh he might uh, he's got a ladybird on him as well well and i think she has as well yeah the more it's like everything the more you look at them the more you see on these things but they're absolutely great and i just thought yeah gotta get those i mean they are actually bookmarks so you've got a page in your book and uh, you would just slot it over the page so that when you're going through your pages you can just come to it next and i think to be honest if you're going to have them particularly if you like working in a work environment and working in a work environment yeah my words aren't brilliant today uh yeah i just think you know if you've got say um dividers sometimes when you've got say a ring binder and you've put the plastic um the plastic pockets in and then you you buy like the divider things you can't actually see those but if you stuck those over the corner of the dividers the cardboard dividers then you'd be able to see those really really easily and you could always just put a little bit of washi tape or something over it to keep it stuck on there uh, and then it'll just easily peel off without tearing the cardboard or without destroying your little bookmark either so yeah lots of ideas but i think these are really cute right let's have a look at these drills see what we've got crystals okay 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 right so we are starting off with a lovely limey a greeny colour that's really pretty a very delicate pink there very nice a lovely bright red that's a definite ladybird red there we've got like a palish grey colour uh, with a crystal back in <gasps> lovely clear crystals a black with a silver back in there exactly the same as the um, black drill we've got is that black <laughs> have a look see if i can get my eyes working properly hmm to be honest that does look like black um with the silver back in and then we've got your black acrylic drills as well to be honest they're actually the same thing they're on the canvas or on your picture or on your project they look exactly the same have they got i would have to get my magnifying glass out to look i think they've both got facets on and uh, yeah just one's got a silver back in that might be a slightly different color it might be a slightly dark gray color but uh, we don't have any dmc codes or anything so we can't really check uh, then we've got a pale pink in the larger rounds we've got a, a larger round uh, with facets in the black we've got some lovely uh, pearly uh, teardrops there with no facets and then some little round gold ones which are like the semi-spheres in uh, gold with no facets so some lovely colours on there do those pinks match those pinks oh not quite just mm, just one shade off i think if you were looking on your colour chart there but yeah very pretty I like those so i have fun doing those and uh, if i don't use them myself you can imagine everybody's going to be getting bookmarks coasters and key rings for christmas <laughs> I do love it when the new products come out and you start seeing all the different ones because you might think yeah i'm not keen on that one i'm not going to get that and then something comes out and you just think yeah, i've just got to have that one that is just superb and i think getting them in a set has worked out quite a bit cheaper as well um you know than buying them singly so yeah but are they all cute <laughs> Uh, if I do get them done and up on my wall, I will let you see them. But at the moment, there's Ooh. my little special drill box and I will start steadily working through my special drills. Okay, and then this is another Liz special. And it's a very, very summery one. 
so let's see what we've got very very nice again another new canvas that uh, seems to have only recently come out we've got our pen boat and wax oh and we are all crystals on this one as well so oh look at that oh there's some good specials in there i love my specials right so we have flip flop heaven so we are on the beach with lots of different flip-flops. So I think this is all friends getting together and they've all just said, well, this is my flip-flop and this is my flip-flop and just throwing them all into a pile and we've just got the sea in the background there lapping away. Do you reckon they've all gone for a paddle? To be fair, I think you ought to really wear your flip-flops when you go for a paddle because, yeah, I'm always frightened something gets me when I go in the sea. <laughs> I don't mean like a shark or anything, but, you know, just in case there's a crab floating around or sat on the bottom. I don't want to stand on anything and hurt it. And, uh, yeah, I have been, uh, when we went to uh, some of the, like, the Spanish islands and things, and uh, we went on holidays there. Um, just putting this down in a minute so I'm not talking over the crinkle. Uh, yeah, we did a walk along, like, an edge of a beach, just like this. And uh, yeah, there was all little fish swimming in between your toes. And I was a bit, didn't quite like that. No, I hope, well, for starters, as I say, I was frightened I was going to step on them. But uh, yeah, no, I can't be doing with things tickling my feet. <laughs> <laughs> but isn't this super? And I just thought there's so many different special drills on it as well. And it's so summery and fresh and bright. And I thought, yep, uh, actually, this would do really well for K, crafting with K's summer fun. Yeah, I'll put the link across uh, and down below as well. That's uh, a great event going on at the moment if you want to go and check it out. Uh, yeah, she's got a couple of sponsors as well. So there's all sorts going on with that. But yeah, that would be really good for the summer fun. Is it summer of colour? No, summer of colour. I don't apologise. So she wants you to do the loveliest, brightest, uh, colourful painting you can. And obviously, I think you can enter more than one as well. So yeah, I might do this one for that try and fit it in with all my other things that I'm doing as well I'm just looking at this and you can see different things I've just realized these are fish so this blue uh, flip-flop we call them flip-flops I understand in Australia I think you call them thongs but thongs are a completely different thing here in the UK I love it how different things have different names and different meanings in different countries it makes me laugh and I'm sure it makes you laugh as well I maybe say things and you think oh we don't call that that <laughs> So yeah, we've got little fish on this one, look, which is really sweet. Uh, we've got flowers and uh, little shells on this one. Looks like we've got like little roses on this one. We've got stripes and a big daisy in the middle on that one. I think that one's just a really spotty one. This one's got spots and stripes. This one's got all flowers on it. That could be a starfish because it's got uh, five on it. And that, they might be starfish. I don't know. That might be a starfish as well. And these have got like, um, oh gosh, are they? Oh, I can't remember what they're called. You'll know what I mean. No, not orchids, but yeah. You know, the flowers with the things that come out. <laughs> That's a technical term. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's give it a quick measure. Uh, what have I done with tape measure? There it is. So it is 11 different gems and colours. So it's quite a quick one to do. Not many changes over in your tray. So we're 25 centimetres, nine and three quarter inches by uh, 35 centimetres, 13 and three quarter inches. So it'll go nicely if you've got any of the magnetic frames, um, which are the 30 by 40 ones, do fit your 25 by 35 uh, canvas area very very nicely so yeah i think i'll be swapping out some of mine downstairs and putting this one in instead let's have a nice bright colorful summer and it's very sunny at the moment as well fortunately it'll probably rain this afternoon now i've said that but uh, yeah we do seem to get every weather in uh, one day in the uk <laughs> i think that's why we talk about the weather so much because it, you can have all four seasons in one day so yeah you, you never know what to wear when you get up in the morning right so oh, okay specials are separate Ooh. so we're starting off with this lovely bright orange color look at these for summery colors 
we've got like a grapey purple colour, a lovely dark blue colour and oh hot pink, oh we had to have a hot pink in here somewhere, can't have a special drill unboxing with that hot pink and then that lovely aqua bluey green colour there and then we have a nice grassy green colour as well so that's your six different crystals, standard size crystals so then we have five special drills so we've got your large rounds uh, with facets like a honey gold we've got your semi spheres these are larger than the ones on the little gonks and uh, yeah they look really good we've got some uh, semi spheres a little pearls look they've got an iridescent coating on the top and then we've got lots of silver marquees Ooh. and then some green marquees Ooh. so let's have a look where these go so number six Seven is number seven. Oh, makes life easier. So number seven is all on this little uh, flip flop here, and on this one. So looks like uh, yeah, that one and that one has uh, the little honey gold faceted ones on. Uh, number eight is number eight. Wow, that's good. So eight is all like so. It's going to look a little bit like studs, isn't it? Once all those gold ones are, are on there. Uh, we've got some more here as well in the centre of the flowers and on the centre of these flowers as well. Oh, and all the stripes are on that. Oh, they'd be difficult to walk on, wouldn't they? Mind you, you might get a massage at the same time. <laughs> and then number nine is uh, all on this pink flip-flop at the top, look. And where else have we got number nine? Have we got any more number nines? No, so it looks like the little pearl ones are all going on there. Again, a little bit iffy to walk on. Good job it's only a picture. <laughs> and then 10 and 11. 10 is going to be all your daisy flowers. So they're going to be a gold middle. It was number eight, wasn't it? Yep, so the, the flowers are mainly going to be... Look at that, getting this stuck to me now. So it's a warm day. A gold middle with your silver petals. And that's going to be on that one as well. And then the greeny ones. Oh, are all on this one, look. So, yeah, uh, they're mainly on that one. Oh, and on this one as well. So they're the leaves and like the little roses as well. Was number four the red one? Oh, no, number four the pink one, is it? Oh, mm, yeah, number four is a hot pink. So we've got pink roses with little green petals. Wow. Oh, that's going to look fab. And it's quite a quick and easy one to do as well. So if you're just wanting to achieve something, it's a hot day, you've come in, you can't relax, you know, when you're buzzing and you think, oh, I need to relax so that I'll sleep tonight or whatever. Sometimes just picking up your diamond painting and just doing something and then you're achieving something at the end of it as well. Just, uh, yeah, helps. Well, it helps me to sleep. Obviously, I can't guarantee that, but it does help me to just relax that little bit and switch off. So... Yeah, that's going to be a great one to do. Looking forward to doing this one. Okay, let's just go back and quickly measure our little gnomes. So they are, oops. Yeah, 10 centimetres, 4 inches square. So yeah, they're a nice little size. But, oh, I love these. Absolutely fabulous. Three little girls and three little boys. I mean, you could even do them in little party bags for children, you know. Um, but I don't know whether they still have textbooks or anything at school, do they? But I know reading is quite a big thing. Um, I know my little granddaughter absolutely loves reading and does have a lot of books at the moment. So, yeah, I think, you know, a little bookmark in a little party bag. And I say that they're not a huge amount of money. It'd be nice if your child had actually made it for the friend as well. Or actually do it uh, as a party and they can all sit down and make one each. And take it home with them. That'd be quite a nice idea. But uh, not in this weather. Well, I suppose you could diamond paint in the garden. If you don't mind the heat, yeah, you could always diamond paint in the garden. So we've had our gorgeous little gonks. Look, I just uh, absolutely love these. Let's just pop them side by side there right well a huge thanks sending me this i absolutely love them you know i love my special drills and these are absolutely fab can't wait to get these done he <laughs> little gnomes oh they're absolutely gorgeous sorry the gonks the gonks you can't see their eyes the gonks <laughs> 
Okay, don't forget to uh, go and check out fgnormal.com as well for all those special offers. And uh, yeah, obviously the special offers are as I've made this video this morning. Um, so do double check when you're checking out and make sure that uh, the offers are still valid as you go through your basket. Right, okay. Well, if you've enjoyed looking at these with me, as always, a thumbs up is very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below. And if you want to come back and see what I get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell that pops up, you'll be notified when any of my videos come up. So you're not going to miss anything. Yay! Okay, thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.